after uh, being in Zurich for a little moment, uh, decided to come up to the uh, town of Regensburg, uh, which will see, you will see in its uh, full beauty actually, as it is. It's on a small hilltop and it is a town that was founded in 1245 by uh, uh, Baron Lutold of uh, Regensburg. So let's go and have a look, all right? Let's go. Regensburg was founded as a hilltop fortified settlement about 1245 by Baron Lutold of Regensburg. The fortification included a 21 meter high round tower dating from the 16th or perhaps 17th century and a 57 meter deep water well. What a pity it's closed. The church, originally dating from the 13th century, was rebuilt in 1506. mid-13th century, relations between the barons of Regensburg and the city of Zurich became strained. At about this same time, the barons began to argue with the Habsburgs over who would inherit the lands of the now extinct Kiborg family. In 1267, the disputes led to a war between the barons and the combined Zurich and Habsburg forces. The barons lost this war and rapidly declined in power over the following half century. In 1302, they sold Regensburg to the Habsburgs. In 1409, the Habsburg Duke Frederick IV known as Frederick of the Empty Pockets, had to pawn Regensburg to the city of Zurich. However, it wasn't until 1417 that Regensburg was fully owned by Zurich. They established a bailiff at Regensburg, which ruled over 13 surrounding villages. Regensburg is now a municipality in the district of Dielsdorf in the canton of Zurich in Switzerland. To finally unwind after a visit of Regensburg, we decided to dine at the local Krone restaurant where we tasted some of Chef Ale Mordassini's sophisticated creations. <laughs> <laughs> 